Okay guys, Major Chord here for an EDC update. Uh, it's been a while since I've done one of these and some things have changed. So, um, before I get too scatterbrained to talk coherently, let's get down to business. Um, first new thing that I don't think I've ever shown before is a comb. I know, what's special about a comb? Well, there's nothing special about this comb. It's a normal comb. I like to look presentable. So that goes in the right front pocket with the Maxpedition Micro Wallet. Um, has enough room for my cards and some cash. It doesn't necessarily hold all the tip money I make, so it just gets jammed in my pocket until I can get bigger bills, but, uh, you know, it, it does what it needs to do. And I got it to replace the Slim Clip because I found that the Slim Clip would really eat up my, my debit card as I pulled it in and out, so I didn't want to have to get a second new one. So, I mean, I, st I still have it and I still use it on occasion, but this has become my primary mode of carrying my important crap. <laughs> um, let's see. Left front pocket. Cell phone. This hasn't changed. It's still the same old cell phone. It does what I need it to do. Which is basically what everything I own does. Um, right front, left front. <laughs> um, I've gotten rid of the Gerber multi-tool. And instead, have started carrying this Victorinox uh, Sportsman. Has a nice size blade. Uh, basic tools, can opener, bottle opener, and probably the most used tool, the nail file, along with a corkscrew and awl, you know, I don't know, I, I actually used the awl or leather punch the other day to make a hole in my brother's belt, so it's come in handy. Um, this I'll often carry if I don't feel like carrying a larger knife or if circumstances don't allow. Uh, this has basically become my performance EDC, you know, I, I don't care, I don't bother carrying the open L, I just carry this. So, we got that. And for a flashlight, I know it's nothing impressive, but it gives me light where I need it. A, uh, what is this? Maglite Solitaire. It was all of five bucks at Walmart, takes a single AAA, and uh, as you see, I have it attached by a lanyard to the Swiss Army knife. So I just have a little compact package to throw in a pocket. Uh, I can throw these in gym shorts if I want to go for a jog. So I have light and a knife and a multi-tool. It's uh, a good light package. I've actually come to like this a lot. And I've used both of these tools quite often, actually. So these I definitely never leave home without. Also go in the right front pocket. <laughs> and uh, let's see. Keys. <laughs> these have changed. I've uh, organized them a bit better. I don't like having a lot of stuff hanging from my ignition, so I put the car keys on a separate little carabiner so I can take it off and just have the keys in the ignition. I've also put, let's see, all my little tools on one separate carabiner so that I can take, you know, take this off and go into a knife-free zone like a high school if I have to. So on here we have a spy capsule from EDC Depot. It's empty. It used to have Tylenol in it. A little Swiss Tech uh, light, which is either broken or out of batteries. It works when it wants to. So I'm probably going to replace this with something else. But, and a, uh, this is my house key. It's on there because I don't want to cluttering up my car keys. And on a separate little keychain on the same carabiner, I have the Swiss Tech Utila key. Uh, hopefully this is in focus. It's a nice little tool. Has, you know, knife, saw, screwdrivers, bottle opener. This is a little handy thing. I don't even notice it's there, and should everything else fail, I got this in reserve. And also a little, uh, <laughs> uh, Victorinox Classic Swiss Army knife. You know, standard nail file, knife, scissors, toothpick tweezers. It's good to have. Um, one day, I actually forgot, as I changed into my work pants, I left this and my larger carry knife in those, and this is the only knife I had at work with me. And since I had to open some boxes, I'm really glad I had it. <laughs> so, car keys, they get clipped to the belt, or if I'm performing like today, um, the rest of these will be left in the car, and these will go with me. Oh, cell phone's going off. <laughs> um, yeah, that that's actually the uh, the communicator tone from Star Trek. I'm quite a Star Trek fan. And uh, a lot of people wonder if that's birds or if it's a dolphin chirping. It's not. 
it's one of my nice nerdy signatures there. Um, so yeah, but this gets separated and I just take the keys in with me. So I'll, probably, I'll be doing that today. Stick them in a tuxedo pocket and not carry all this bulk. And uh, what everyone's probably waiting for, my knife of choice recently, is the Kershaw Clash. I picked this up a little while back, a couple weeks ago. I love it. Um, during the school year, when I was on campus and stuff, I'd carry my bird Kara Kara too, um, or another larger knife that could be used for self-defense. Not that I really know how to, but peace of mind, I guess you could say, to have that there. And a smaller knife for people-friendly stuff. Um, this thing, besides having the speed safe assisted opening, is built like a tank. Ergonomic, good traction, um, really no jimping, but it really fills your hand, and I've found it to be a good work knife. <laughs> Wonderful carry knife, and uh, kind of cool to fondle and play with. But if this isn't people friendly enough, there's always this. So over the summer, I can, you know, lighten my EDC a bit and just carry. You know, a bit lighter, um, especially because I'm wearing shorts, and I don't, I don't like weighing down my cargo pockets with stuff. So, <laughs> this is a good knife to carry. Um, it's a bit husky, but like I said, it's built like a freaking tank, and it comes out like there's no tomorrow. So, <laughs> I think that's about it. Um, other than my watch, which is not on my wrist, it is upstairs in my bedroom. I'm not going to bother getting that. A watch is a watch. It's another one of those cheap $5 watches from Big Lots. Um, yeah. So this has been Major Chords EDC for May 2011. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day. I know I will be. I'll be singing. I have a duet. Um, some nice show tunes. It's going to be a good concert. Um, should the world happen to end tonight at 6 p.m., um, everyone enjoy the rapture. And, uh, you know, enjoy boiling in hell or whatever whatever that crazy hoot says you'll be doing. So, have a nice day, guys. Thanks for watching. Take care. God damn it, that's cutlery lovers. <sighs> Several months and I still can't find a good ending. Oh well, we'll work on it.